to Finns on four and more bad news tonight on the injury front for your Miami Dolphins. Yeah, first it was Ryan Tannehill, of course, now an up-and-coming rookie has been hit hard by the injury bug. CBS 4's Mike Cuneo joins us now with more. Mike, tell us about it. Oh, man, the Dolphins just can't catch a break. Last night, middle linebacker Raekwon McMillan left the game before getting a chance to take a single snap on defense. After an impressive camp, McMillan was projected to be a starter for the Finns, but here's where his season ended. He actually collides with Dion Lacey, one of his own teammates on punt coverage. He's being diagnosed with a torn ACL in his right knee and will need surgery. Now, as for the rest of last night's preseason opener, some young receivers got to show out. Leontay Carew made a nice play on the ball to reel in a 33-yard touchdown that gave the Miami the lead. Then Demore Stringfellow introduces himself in a big way, breaking off a 99-yard touchdown catch and run. After hooking up with David Fales, he turned on the burners to put the fins in the win column 23-20. Although the game doesn't count, it was good to get those jitters out of the way. All our young guys tried to play as fast as they could. And, you know, it didn't feel like we had a lot of mistakes. I mean, we'll go back and look at the tape and... And, you know, we'll see what happened. We try to stay very basic, let our guys play fast and just kind of show us where they're at. And I thought the guys, you know, they fought and kept playing hard. Now, roster cuts won't happen until after the final preseason game. So there's plenty of reps out there for guys trying to make the team. Next week, we could finally see new QB Jay Cutler suit up for the Fins. That's what we've been waiting for. That's, That's what we've right. been waiting for ever since Ryan Tannehill went down. It's the most important position in maybe all of sports. So maybe we'll see Jay Cutler get his chance and hopefully... See him for a few reps. Last night we used to get to see Matt Moore for about three plays. He threw one pass, completed it, but still not a lot to go on. And there. you hate to see more injuries, but right. you know what they say in the NFL? It's football. Next, next man up. Next man up. And I know a lot of fans out there are wondering why, if he was supposed to be a projected starter at middle linebacker, why was he out there? Look, special teams is something <laughs> all the young guys sure. play and have to play. And you want them to be out there to get as many reps yeah, as you can right. in, in case they need them in any situation. And so look how fragile it is, too. You yeah, know, that, that quickly he's done for the season, unfortunately. And it was, and it was a free, kind of a freak play. Right. His own player ran into him. And, you know, it's just hard to see, but that's football. That is football. Thank you, Mike. And yes. we get another dose of football next right. week. I love it. A reminder, the Dolphins' second preseason game is just six days away. That's next Thursday night, August 17th from Hard Rock Stadium. Kickoff is set for 7 p.m. right here on CBS4, the official home of your Miami Dolphins.